On Friday, a new batch of 16 persons were installed as part of the annual Chinese Medical Brigade at a ceremony that also commemorated the signing of a Friendship Hospital's Memorandum of Understanding and the signing of the agreement for the specialist training program. A number of medical equipment were also handed over to the Georgetown Public Hospital Corporation, GPHC. The GPHC and Yangzhou Sebi People's Hospital, located in Jaisung Province, first signed a friendship agreement in 2015. Members of the Medical Brigade will be posted to the GPHC and Linden Hospital complex, as has been the practice over the last 30 years, with the first brigade arriving in Guyana in 1993. Since then, the number of Chinese medical volunteers have grown and has now doubled the amount sent to Guyana in 2022. During the ceremony held at the GPHC's Resource Center, Chinese Ambassador to Guyana Guai Haiman said she was happy to elevate the cooperation with Guyana in this regard. She's optimistic about the continuous training of Guyanese doctors and noted that from a total of 12 Guyanese selected for the scholarships in China this year, eight are studying medicine. Uh, we will continue to uh, uh, continue the uh, training program um, for uh, Guyanese resident doctors. Um, and we, uh, as I know, the program has been improved uh, based on last year's feedback. Health Minister Dr. Frank Anthony said the Ghana government was extremely grateful for the ramped up cooperation, which comes in the same year Ghana and China are observing 50 years of diplomatic relations. And what was also very important in this relationship is not just that the doctors came in and did surgery and they left. What was important was that they did surgery and they teach their local counterparts how to do these types of surgery. And just over the last uh, two years or so, we would have made lots of headlines because uh, the team did some very complex surgeries here at the Georgetown Hospital without uh, the assistance of the Chinese consultants who were, were involved in these surgeries we would not have been successful. Dr. Anthony is happy that the training opportunities will extend beyond GPHC and the Linden Hospital Complex under this new program. For the, oh, I can't tag out.